In the properties of matter activity, we're going to describe various physical properties of matter. These are properties that when you observe them or measure them do not change the substance. The first property is viscosity. High viscosity means a thick liquid that flows very slowly. Here we can compare corn syrup and water. Now let's describe the material as either malleable, meaning you can bend it and change its shape, or brittle, meaning it just crumbles. Here we can look at sulfur and tin. Elasticity is whether a substance is stretchy or rigid. Let's compare steel wire to a rubber band. Another physical property is color. If something is a conductor, electricity can pass through it. We can test this with a conductivity tester. By touching the two wires, if the light turns on, it's a conductor. If the light does not turn on, it's an insulator. Sodium chloride, or salt, does not conduct electricity. Neither does distilled water or pure water. But if you put them together in salt water, they do conduct electricity. If something is magnetic, a magnet will stick to it. Not all metals are magnetic. We can describe the odor as strong or weak and maybe identify it. Mm. 
There's a strong odor like nail polish remover. The very strong odor, like cleaning supplies. Very strong odor, like rubbing alcohol. No odor. No odor. A weak alcohol smell. If something is soluble, that means it dissolves. Here we'll see if various substances are soluble in water. Here we can see if various substances are soluble in acetone. And these substances are soluble or insoluble in ethyl alcohol. Now we can look at chemical properties of matter. These are properties that when you test them or observe them, you change the substance into something new. We can look at flammability and flame color. Here are flame tests for different liquids. The first test is ethyl alcohol. 
is flammable and it's burning half blue, half orange. The second flame test is hydrogen peroxide. It does not burn. This third chemical is acetone. You can see that it's mostly orange, but also blue on the bottom. Ammonia does not burn. The fifth substance is methyl alcohol. You can see the methyl alcohol burns blue with a few orange specks in it. Next up is isopropanol, also mostly orange, but it is blue on the bottom. And our final chemical is water, which does not burn. Here are flame tests with various solid powders. The first powder is sodium chloride. It's burning orange. The second powder is strontium chloride. It's burning red. The third one is calcium chloride, burning yellow. Copper chloride is burning green. Lithium chloride is burning dark red or pink. Potassium chloride is burning a light purple. Ammonium chloride is burning yellow. And at the end is iron, which does not burn. Here is magnesium, a solid metal, catching on fire and burning. This is a flammable metal that burns a very bright white color.